What's happening, everybody in Room Master? Welcome back to Breathage. And I went out on a bunch of resource gathering stuff. I scanned the table that we couldn't get last time. And yeah, basically, I just got a whole lot of resources. I need to grab some fuel before we leave. And I need to make sure do I have? Yes. Two, four, six, eight, nine. I should have enough so we can go launch that rocket into the whatever causing radiation. Yeah, fuel, here we go. Like, I'm pretty sure I have fuel for my... for my little vacuum ship thing. Yes, fill you up, because I'm at 17 fuel right now. Which is not where I'd like to be. So, first things first. We're gonna go in here, we're gonna try to launch that rocket, and then there's an area that I haven't been to that I want to examine over here, but after that, it was pretty much done here. And then it's off to, like, that area over there. But... Yeah, I want to do this one first. I want to say that there's something else in here too. I just don't remember. It's been so long. I want to explore more of this. I didn't come in here because it's freezing. No, that's not. That's not fun. I don't want to freeze to death. All right. Uh, you. What you holding? And you have your head in a box. I'm so confused. There's nothing else here, right? I'm just gotta double check this area before we leave. Freezing danger. Something is stuck in the cooling gel, or someone. In any case, it's impossible to break it. Okay. It's impossible to break it. Is it though? I feel like you're giving me some sort of challenge. Oh yeah. Give me oxygen. I wouldn't touch it without having a degree in engineering. If I were you, I wouldn't touch anything, even myself. Quote, yeah. Herat Demonstrandum. Seems that you still made the engine run, though this has complicated the identification of the deceased. Slightly. How did this survive the... Launch and the reduction? Okay. How did it survive? Just lit on fire. Alright, so yeah, this is just a little story bit. Is there anything else in here? So this isn't warming me up, right? No. No, I'm still freezing. Still very much freezing. Alright, I think I saw a warmer. That's not a warmer. Ah, there's one right here. I'm just going back to this one. So there was something else here. I just couldn't remember what it was. So I figured to make sure to look around first. I'm going to try to get everything that I can. Eh, why not? I have so many of those things. I might as well keep myself fully... Fully stocked. Oh, there's a heater literally right there. Anything else? Thing at the bottom. Nope, don't see anything. Let's say I checked some of these. I didn't see anything in most of them. Alright, let's do this. And stop. Alright, so fuel. Okay, they're all loaded. Um, all right. I think you're almost there. You can probably ignore the cooling gel's slight course deviation and assume that the core's activity is partially reduced. Okay. <laughs> That's always good. I vaguely remembered that, but I didn't remember exactly. Okay. Oxygen is not limited. Oh, God. I didn't even notice the oxygen. I don't think there's any way I'm going to make this. I have an oxygen candle, but... Like usual, I prefer not to use it. No, I'm just gonna use it. I don't care. Oh, I don't care. This is down. This down here. I went up to that place with the electrical suit, but I have not been down here where there's also a bunch of electricity. So this is what I figured I'd go through this time. I mean, it says there is something over there. I'd probably take this thing over it. There's lots of things down here. Oh, and I wanted to make an EMP, and I remember why now, because I think that's how we get the core thing. So much right there. Whatever. Whatever, I'm down here, I'll go back that way. I think we saw this part, yeah, the jam-covered thing. 
Uh. Oh, let me go check this out. I, I think I need to stop here, though. Yeah. I don't want to get my vehicle destroyed or wrecked or anything. This is an energy core of the Breath Edge Company. I don't know who transported such technologies on the liner and for what purpose it was done, but now it's easy to explain the presence of electromagnetic anomalies. By the way, I don't recommend turning off the active core. It will most likely lead to unpleasant consequences. <laughs> okay. Sounds like fun, though. What's up, buddy? What do you do? Hey, you got the scrapper. The scraper. All right, see, I do want to turn this off, though. I want to take that, but I gotta get, like, I think I need an EMP to turn it off. It's not connected to anything right now. It's literally connected to right there. Alright, well, I don't see anything else here. But, I mean, I got the scraper. That alone is something. It's at least progression. Uh, items. Uh, I, well, I guess the thing I don't have to learn in the research. Alright, let's go this way. Got another auction candle. That would be nice to find another auction lead. Well, I mean, there's one. Nope, never mind. Not nearly as close as I thought there was. Down. Yeah, no, we've seen this. I'm confused. Am I in the wrong one? I guess maybe over there is where I wanted to go. I don't know. I know is that there's no auction things over here. So <laughs> I'm gonna be using another auction candle and making sure that I'm heading back. Okay, so exit the vehicle. Ooh, that just put me in a different direction. Can get past this. A dead, independent software developer. Do you know what independent development is? It's something stupid, like when two young fools take their dad's computer and try to make a game about space chickens. Wait a minute. <laughs> I love this one. Can I take anything? Yes. Uh, take. Alright. I need option. My last one, though. I need to make sure to be heading back. Look in here real quick. I'm seeing electricity, but I don't know. Nope, alright. Alright, back in here. Back on my vehicle. Oh, I'm out of gas. Yo. This is why I always take two of them with me, just in case. I don't have to keep going back. And at the same time, if I end up running out of All stuff... All these coffins belong to the batch for the year 2020. This was the golden age of the Breath Edge Funeral Agency, but it's unclear what these old coffins are doing among this debris. So this is where they're buried. What? Okay. Honesty, freedom, democracy. I take this. Sure. No, take it. No, take it. The posters of the Breath Edge Company are always very life affirming. Okay. I think we're good here. Just a little story bit. Is there somebody in this one? No? See, I can't pop any of them open unless there's people inside. Alright, um... I'm a little concerned by the lack of oxygen right now. I feel like I did not go the right one still. Please don't make this thing go crazy. Uh, is it, there's something in here? Andy, I soap? If he hadn't worn soap over his suit, would he have survived? Oh. Alright, well. Yeah, I need to get back. <laughs> I need to get back. I could have sworn there's like solar panels or something out here. I remember seeing something like that. I just don't remember where it was now. I don't know. I guess it's uh, for another time. It takes cinema debris. <laughs> Watch the inciting movie. You fly there in the main. Stay close to an anti asteroid turret. It signals from there. Yeah. Why am I going so slowly right now? 
What is happening? Okay, yeah, I was like, man, I'm moving really slow and I don't have the oxygen for this. What is happening? I'm now, like, legitimately worried. I wasn't worried until this moment. And apparently I chose the wrong path. Oh, Lord. Right there. Think we're gonna be good? When we cut into close? Oh, this is just... This is... Seriously, the oxygen all over in Subnautica. Go! I mean, I'm pretty sure... Yeah, we're gonna be good. We're gonna be good. I say this just to comfort myself. I'm not sure. Alright. Inside we go. There we go. Everything's fine. Alright. I can go put some stuff. Uh, I'm just gonna throw you in the corner with everything else. Boop. And... Boop. This one just goes on the wall right here. There we go. <laughs> Alright. And I, I, I'm, I'm, no, I'm not good. I say I'm good. I'm just gonna go right back out. But I want to take two. Always taking those just to be on the safe side. All right, I'm gonna go this way. I guess maybe I'll go back there and check it some other time. Is that is that one of the things we're supposed to do? I don't know. Going over here first. One that's a thousand meters, there's stuff that's up here. There's so many things all over the place. Alright, well, what are you? I'm, I'm, I'm hoping there's auction over here. Right? Speakers at the pleasure shuttle, ripped out and connected Ooh. with the help of a cheap extension cord. Alright. Dan? I got a speaker. Looks like he was trying to attract attention by playing loudly on his guitar, his acoustic guitar, and using I a can now make a guitar in space. <laughs> yeah, it's not gonna work. Ever son? Oh, it's an actual tape. We could play that in the thing. Ooh, I got more oxygen. All right, means I can stay out even longer. Hooray! Uh, extract plastic. Nah, I'm good. I will take the wire though. Take it when I remember seeing it. Back on here. Okay. I'm gonna go. I, I don't know. There's so many directions to go here. Oh, that's a turret. That's a turret. A turret. Be careful. Yeah, isn't there a way to deactivate you? Not directly in front of you. There's an engineering shuttle ahead. I wonder how you find everything so quickly. What? Is it because of my hints? Where? What? What are you talking about? Where? Okay. Oh, <laughs> how do you find everything so easily? I can't even find it and it just told me about it. Alright. <laughs> Down here real quick. Well, I can at least get myself some oxygen. And see if there's any tools inside. That's a familiar way of repairing things. Did you study the same manual as well? <laughs> really? And oh, okay. So I didn't have to reason. I get it. will fly with a broken engine, but the design of the steering wheel is quite interesting. All right. Well, I have three of the five, the four now. I say the five, but no, there's only four. Postcard for the photo of the first time a car launched in space. But it was taken not so long ago by the famous traveler, I Max. Up the moment, I believe that. Car was shown by the gravity of some planet and destroyed. Yep, and I can see it being drawn in by a planet. Yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> it's going like right at a planet. All right, well we're good on oxygen. Put this thing away. Hop back on here. All right. Oh, uh, where are we closest to? 900, 800, 900. There's so many places. Gonna be a place I just pop into and just leave stuff at when I need to. Oh, and I remember this. The service post, about two meters of high strength alloy, and no breaches in the security system. The object is classified, but I managed to download some information from the captain's bridge. You can remotely access the liner's core from here. This would be extremely useful. However, it is impossible to get inside unless you have an anti-armor weapon. 
This is working autonomous oxygen station. What? Okay, cool. Try to deactivate this thing first. Oh, I see it right there. Oh, God. Woo! Aha! That's what I have to say about that. Don't you have something cool? Yeah! Discharge cell. Wait, there's another turret. Okay, so that one's off. Oh, God, it's right there! Woo! Bob and Weave! The other one can't see me right now. We're good? Oh, God, there's another one there. Alright. Taking yours. You're mine now. Oh, we can see me right here. Nope, nope, nope. Oh, it's in a bad place. Oh, no, I can utilize this. Right here, we just hugged the wall. That's right. Now give me your core as well. Okay. <laughs> danger, danger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know where the danger's at right now. Legit don't see anything. But whatever. I'm going to leave my vehicle there for a second. I'll just come right... Eh, maybe I'm not. Yes, I am. <sighs> you know what? No, I have the oxygen. I don't need to go back there. I'll wait. I'm sorry. I'm like completely just... There's so much to do out here. This part's fun. Now there's turrets and there's actual threats. I think the only one still active is that one over there, though. What? Where? Oh, it's already... Okay. Yeah, that one's already off. That's what I thought. Woo! What's up, buddy? How's it going? Okay, is that that one? Alright, we're good. Okay, give me your power thing. Is that the last one? I think that may have been the last one. You need to see all the stuff from where they're just shooting at. Ooh, I should probably use this. I knew I was gonna need it, but... I hate portals. What? Ball with the what? Hamster ball with the pet hamster is quite durable and heavy design, capable of even crush bones. Apparently, this hamster bit a part of its master through the holes in the hole and ate it. Oh, that's. You can lose your oh, head. I didn't mean to take reasons, that one. But this case is especially interesting. <laughs> this is Knight Errant, the main weapon of the liner unnamed. It was meant to be used only in cases of emergency when the liner was attacked from the outside. Who would attack it, and what makes Knight Errant different from other turrets? The journalists didn't get a clear answer. All right. Uh, what do we got nearby. Okay, I got another one of these things. I feel like yeah, there's a whole collection of them. Stuff with the black hole in the background was the first and last one in history. <laughs> the turret up top? It looks like Knight Errant's manual control panel. It's used in case of remote control system failure. Getting gear from inside the liner was impossible, therefore it was there are no data about the discharge cells or any modern particle beam weapon in general. Oh. But according to the blueprint, it's somewhere inside the gun's barrel. I don't think you should poke your nose in there. A repair tool required. Oh, I need the repair. I literally have it right here. Alright, now I can refill my oxygen here and I don't even have to go back. And that's what those things are for. I thought they were for actually making something cool. Apparently, they're just simply to, uh, do this. Where's the turret that you keep telling me about? I mean, there's the one way over there, but I'm good here, I think. <laughs> Don't go in the barrel, that's right, that's what it said. Where I need to go, I need to go in the barrel. If the gun doesn't work, it doesn't mean you can... Apparently, these are the discharge cells. It's unlikely that you'll be able to fix them, but I'm sure that there are some... Got one. <laughs> Second discharge cell installed. I hope it doesn't start firing right away once you've fixed it. Yeah, ideally, that's not what I want. Only one Do left. I have five? Oh, I gotta get one more. Alright. Go. Uh, there's still Turret a bunch active. of these. Be careful. Yeah, I see you. I'm not worried. I move faster than you. 
is this? Do you seagulls really vit curious beasts of garbage yourself in okay? I heard about big ships being infested not only by hamsters, but even by seagulls, though I did not think it was true. Seems like this one was eating garbage. Alright, that was that's weird. <laughs> oh! There's a turret right there! I thought it was up here. Hey, where is your power thing? Nope. I thought that was I thought that was it. That was not it. Seriously. I'm just like on a random part of the ship? I think I chose the wrong one. Oh there it is. Alright, turn you off. Heroic deed achievement. I wasn't even doing it as a heroic deed. I was simply doing it because I needed to, to like, use the weapon. This. Glass? Faceted glass, the most common glass in history. This one is very, isn't very clean, though. Is that bird poop? Uh, I'm gonna leave that. I don't want that. Anything inside of this? No? Alright. Well, we're good. I just want to see that I don't want I want to make sure there's nothing here to scan. Guns nearby. Keep saying that, but I don't know where. But you said earlier too. Yeah, whatever. Let's go up here to my actual oxygen and mission. I want to fill this up. I don't want to. I don't want to die out here. Uh, and we still got a lot. Holy crap. Do 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 do. Let's go put the last bit in there. Be good. We need to get in this. I'm gonna go over here real quick. Just want to what see a what's here. Place, but maybe we can find something useful here. Oh, those over there are mad at me. Okay. That's fine. I'm still far, far enough away. Ooh, is this gonna? Is this oxygen? I didn't even have to fill up on oxygen. Really? It's not recommended no, to disassemble space beds. Although it's not clear why, it's hard to find a simpler object. All right, now I got the bed. That's exactly what I wanted. It's one of the ones I was really open to find. This is this open to space? Yeah, it's very much open to space. I want to go out there. Is there anything up here? Nada. All right. Well, I got a bed now. Build that so I can actually sleep to get my health back up. Turret signal. Be careful. Yeah, I know. It's right there. And then there's one last thing here, and then I'll go activate the thing. Uh, you right here. What do you got for me? Scannables. I'm gonna be upset because I don't have anything. Oh, we got another one. Grumpy cat. The shape cat. Of the Grumpy's collection. <laughs> there's so many different ones. Click, click edge two. Oh yeah, this. I mean, I can actually build a computer and play these games. I know click edge two was like a, it's like this absurd little thing they added. Oh, it was my legs and they scared me. All right, and I know there's things in there I can go get, but I can't get them until I have a suit that I don't die. So, can't do it quite yet. All right, and. Last one. And we're done. I might be wrong, but is Knight Errant preparing to shoot? I don't know. I'm moving. I can tell you that much. No, it's not. But okay. I'm starting to understand why you repaired this weapon. I'd like to warn you that shooting from it is pure madness. Therefore, I strongly recommend not to come near Knight Errant's manual control panel. Take the joystick in your hand, direct the weapon into the tree, and press the fire button. Knight Errant is in running order. <laughs> All right. Yes, yeah, we'll do I that. had exactly the same idea. Knight Errant must break through the airlock's armor, damaging the latching mechanism. Try aiming and shooting at the lower latch so as not to damage the module. Seems like you only have one shot before the weapon's batteries go completely flat. Fire! <laughs> mm, uh, well, uh, I'm not sure this is a good time to comment, but the shot didn't go well. Although you did damage the armor for sure, together with half the equipment. <laughs> Yeah, it kind of... I mean, when it slices like this, how you... Yeah. What are you supposed to really do? No. <laughs> what 
what are you supposed to really do? The complex entry control system. The system was so complex that it was the first one to fail. However, this doesn't prevent the door from remaining armored. We won't find any other way into the module anyway. Oh, okay, so I was supposed to do that beforehand. Uh, one of these is not like the other? Right here. With such damage, we won't be able to control the core remotely, but we can use the core protection protocol and open additional cooling valves in the liner. For that, find the central panel and try to guess the nine-digit password. Well, I want to get this stuff first. I always try to find all that extra goodies. I can't get in here and get in here. Right, we're walking? Yeah. In forest metal. I like coming into these places because there's always like really good refined materials. You know, I don't know if there's ever a point to do this, but it always just makes me feel good. <laughs> I don't know why. Uh, give me that. Oh, what did I just get? Eh, whatever, I'll max it out. I always have so much of that stuff. Roll of fabric, definitely. Okay. All this. Keep going inside. Saving. Health pack. Another one of these little dudes. What's up, buddy? A detailed plan of the habitation module. Oh, no! I don't have another scanner, man! Dude, I gotta go so far to get another scanner! Oh, do I have a battery? Oh, dude. Maybe I'll get lucky and find a scanner in here. I'm not gonna get lucky and find a scanner in here. <laughs> I wanna get that so bad. I'll have to come back here. I probably won't. I'll, I'll either. I'll. Probably not do it in the recording then. Uh, I'll have to scan something else. I'm just gonna go back, I guess. You're fully sealed up. All right, with all kinds of goodies. I don't want to hit this. That one's one I turn off just so I don't accidentally step on. Most likely the passenger died because of a harmless toy that clogged the air outflow. Sometimes a dust collector is still worth cleaning, although this leads to interesting design solutions. Okay, Grumpy Bear, it's another one. How many are there? Good lord. Oh, my inventory's full, are you serious? A detailed plan of the service module. Dude, I'm gonna have to go back. Yeah, I remember there's even more stuff to scan. I'll be right back. All right, go medium habitation module. Uh, buh, buh, buh. the other one's right here, and I think it, I think it was the small one. Yeah, small service module. All right, oh yeah, and I emptied all my inventory, so I have all that space. I have space to grab everything now. Oh, I can scan it. I didn't realize it was a scan. I thought I was just gonna grab it. Got a handy scrapper. Automatic maintenance team. I wouldn't touch them unless necessary. Uh, all right. It's resin. Pretty sure I'm fine and going through here, right? I know these things are angry, right? They're not nice. Can't remember. I'm gonna break you real quick. They used to repair each other. This used to be a nightmare to deal with this thing. All right. Now I can just hit the crap out of these things. Just... I really hope I'm gonna have enough for this. I'm not. Oh my God, am I really gonna have to go back to the ship again? Dude. All right, there's there's no way because there's still a whole like two I have to do. Is one of these things I can open right now? Wait, could I have just hit the door the whole time? Swear to God! Swear to God! Why did you what? Ah! Is there anything down here that's hidden? Squeeze into anything? No. Got any more handy scrappers? 
All right. Well, can I at least take down this one? Nope, it broke. Oh my god. Oh my god. All right. What about the other side of the hallway? This is what I just scanned. Where I just came from? Oh, I can't go that way. Oh, man. Well, hey, guess what? I can scan this. I've already done it, but... Rocket Vacuum Part 2 of 3? Maybe I haven't. I thought I did. Alright, whatever. Give me that. Oh, what do I have on me? A whole bunch of this? What does it take for it? Yeah, right here. Equipment tools. Oh, just refined metal and titanium? Oh, I got that. Alright. I'll be right back again. What? Okay, I'm really confused right now. Okay, so I came back with two of these scrappers and the robots were alive again? So I... I got all upset. I left and I made two explosives and I just came back again. And they're not here anymore? Which is good. I mean, I can destroy all these things. That's everything, right? I guess I just started to have to break this door. Maybe that's for this one then. No? What was the point of this? Oh, it was just. Oh, was it really just to like distract them from. Oh, God. I think it was just to distract them from this. Oh, well, whatever. I did things this the hard way. The central panel. I knew the password. On the first try, that was easy. <laughs> you unable to lie. You could not just do something and not break something. Tell truth. <laughs> Confirm. Okay. Oh. I suspected the panel is a bit out of order, but judging by the sensors, an undocumented passage was hidden under it. Okay. Anything else Someone in here by chance? Break lamps because it doesn't look a bit like repair work. All right. Anything to scan? Oh, give me all this stuff. I want to say it's like this. Reason I want to make sure I do everything now. I can't remember. All right. Well, let's go down here. There's no information about these rooms. Something happened here. Although you've probably already noticed it. Molten metal piece. All right, sure, I'll the take that. Of a military blaster. Oh, Civilians there we go. don't have access to such technologies. If you try to assemble such a weapon, I will be forced to send a report to proper authorities through the damaged communication channel in your suit. The cause of death is a blunt injury to the head. How the death? His arm is gone. I mean, I guess so is his face, but there's that. Uh, the Green Nerf has always been a rather uncoordinated organization. Despite the presence of a leader, there was no six... Curious coordination in their actions up to this point. Good success on the subject. Okay. Uh, I'm just like floating around. Console? It's definitely one of the Breath Edge Agency coffins, but its ID is missing in my database. All right. Burnt piece of uh, once secret document that reveals some information about the core of the liner unnamed. Newspapers never mention the fact of using modern technology. Reading core used to development field, the potential power exceeded that bounds. Uh, alright. New hyperspace, so they're testing hyperspace. It, oh, I think I learned that. So it's before. not the size that makes the liner unnamed unique, but its latest energy core. Maybe that's what drew the attention of the Green Universe radicals? We'd better forget this classified information. Looks like you're not the only one who's fond of destroying important equipment. Now I can't even connect to this panel. What's left now is to break the rest of the stuff around here, and there's a chance that this will activate some core protection protocol. Or, alternatively, kill someone in this room. 
Or <laughs> kill someone in this room. Yes, I'm the only one in this room. The other person's already dead. Well, you don't have a health right here. A decrease in the core's activity detected. It looks like you were able to start the protection protocol, although the ship's documentation says it's only possible during a natural disaster. You've got talent. Alright. <laughs> uh guess we're good here then? We cannot deny the fact that Green Universe was involved in the crash of the liner, but some details in their behavior at death don't correspond to the modus operandi of the attack. No, it was just an open up, I was just making sure there's nothing else. Alright, well we did we did good here. Yes. Uh yeah, and I can't go this way at all, no? So <laughs> Spend all the time breaking those consoles for nothing. Makes me sad. Put all this away. Yeah, I guess I'm gonna peace out. Make sure I didn't miss anything in here. I don't think so. No. I could break those guys open. I don't know what they give me, but. I don't see the point. Make sure. That... I just wanna make sure there's nothing else to scan. Alright. <clears throat> here we go. Uh, there's a place not too far from where we are right now that's really far away from everything else, so I figure let's go over and check that out. Cowboy hat. Boost! Go fast! Yeah, we can definitely get here in no time. We can also go down there. I think I needed paint for something. It looks like there's paint right there. So that could be super useful. And I, yeah, I was gonna say I do have auction candles, right? <laughs> it just hit me because I, I don't know. There's there's no oxygen up here. I can just go back in that ship there, I guess. Oh yeah, isn't this like a brilliant idea how to enhance the handy scrapper? Infinite handy scrapper. All right. Got about that. <laughs> Freaking Chuck Norris thing. Infinity Warrior, great and terrible. This guy is so tough that there is no one who fle flies in space. It's space that flies in him. Alright. <laughs> Alright. Give me metal. Now I can make an infinite scrapper. Ah, I'm stuck. Is there anything else in here? I'm already in here? No. I can't even move. I'm like legit stuck. It was weird. It's like hitting invisible walls. Alright, nothing else here. Let's go down to this. See if I'm grabbing some paint. And then I guess from here, let's kind of circle around down to there. The other places I wanted to explore that were over here, but they're much further away from where we are right now. Okay, paint. More paint. Oop, I just passed it. Did I hit it and make it go flying? Nope, it's right there. I could get some out of here, but I would prefer to just pick it up and not waste my drill. I don't need a ton. Seems to be a good amount of floating around. Alright, whatever. We're good. Anything else around back here? No. Now we got this weird mayonnaise thing. This is the stuff that you can... I think this one's hard. Yep, this one's a hard one. I think you could fly into this stuff or something. Someone clearly does not like standard space food. Even the liner's kitchen didn't have such equipment. Oh, it doesn't open. What? Oh, get in here. What? Okay, I'm like, there's gotta be a way in. Box with food, stop stealing my sandwiches. Be easy to open the lock, but I fear the products inside are either spoiled or spoiled on purpose. If someone is constantly stealing your food, do not, under any circumstance, mix it with a laxative, an emetic, or red pepper. But I would not open this box if I were you. Okay. I know auction is not unlimited, and I don't care. I'm not in a hurry. Uh, scan the kitchen? Alright. Anything else in here? Big wire, wire, okay. Use that so the music stops because it freaks me out. Alright. Uh, what was this? 
Uh, cooking magazines were very popular, especially among those who would not learn to cook anything more than difficult than hot water. Perhaps there is some psychological wisdom in this. Yeah, alright. I am going to go back over here. We have a kitchen now. That's a new bit. So this is here. There was one. There was a place that was like in between. But now that I'm here, I want to check this place out. A large part of the mayonnaise is frozen, but there is some strange activity in some of the balls. If it really is mayo, as indicated in the invoices. All right. It looks like the mayo tanks weren't only on the port side. There's a chance to find something here that can be launched into the core. This is. I have no idea who would need that amount of mayo in space, but we need to find a way to get Jeez, this so much stuff. the liner's core to reduce its activity. The victim may have tried to press the barbell with his Adam's apple, but this presumption may not be accurate. <laughs> All right. Get off here. Uh, I do have my repair thing still, right? Yes, right there. Uh, okay, no, go to this. Repair! Now I have lots of oxygen. I can explore this little area too. Alright, are we good? Alright. Class equipment of weightlifting it helps to develop almost any major muscle group if it's not lying around in the garage, of course. Alright, oh, I can scan the workbench? Alright. Yo, I got a workout bench. And now I got a crazy picture. My last bodybuilder is a sensory limited limitation of protein foods, lacks of necessary pharmacology. Unified clothing sizes managed to defeat even such sturdy guys. Okay. Bodybuilding is a sports culture of the past. It died together with its followers because they loved to tear their spacesuit to demonstrate their muscles. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> yeah, that seems like a terrible idea. Let me just refill my oxygen one more time, and then we'll go out there. Alright, we're good. Okay, uh, go up. So I wanted to go into the balls of mayonnaise. Great idea. In addition to good speed, your magnificent transportation is vibrating so hard that by the divergent waves it produces, I can calculate the nearest obstacles and project them on your helmet screen. Uh, wait. Nope, actually I can. Oh, my inventory's full? Are you serious? Food, water, food, water. Uh, I got so much garbage in here, but I want to take. I want to keep it. Magazine with attractive girls with sticky pages. Better not to touch it without a spacesuit. Although even a spacesuit is not recommended to do so. Seems like it's not mayonnaise. Ew. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> oh, it would have been fine if you not said that, and then you said that, and now it's like no. All right. Is there anything in here? Is this just a toilet? Alright, well there's nothing in this one really. Let me let me out. Where's the exit? How do I get out of this thing? What? Alright. Go in here? Okay, tape recorder. Let's get out of my way. What's this? Judging by the pants stains the owner of the underpants was pushed from behind. Who did it? Why they did it? why did they do it? Where did they push the owner, and how did the underpants get separated from the body will be remain a mystery forever. Sure, I'll take underpants. Whoa. Poop me out inside the ship? Ooh! A strange place, but maybe we can find something useful here. Alright, I want to scan this for sure. One of three. Uh, I thought so. I don't think I ever found all three before. I only ever found one. Or two. Okay, oxygen wise, uh, I should probably go find some more. Anything special? Nope, nothing inside. Alright, that was not it. That was the kitchen. Where was the oxygen? Right there. Went way too low. I don't see anything connected here. A. Can I fill up on here? I hope so. Yes. 49 fuel too, so I'm not even worried about running out of fuel anytime soon. Do, 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 do. And we're good. We're good? We're good? Come on, yes. I, I, I want to leave early, but at the same time, I want to make sure I'm actually maxed out. Alright. 
come up here. Check this one. Is this one actually okay? That one's solid. Never mind. Going on over here. Oh, I'm stuck. Examine. All right, I'm picking up so much garbage. So much garbage. All right. Can I go in this one, or are you solid? Are you solid too? I can go in here. Detaching the bracket without getting your hands as well as other parts of your body dirty will be impossible. What? What are you talking about? So confusing when you're in there. Alright. Oh, because I have to do something with this, right? So turn this? I gotta get off here. A very odd composition, but apparently this mayo doesn't want to freeze. There's also no danger to the spacesuit's material, but I'm not sure it's reasonable to stay here with such visibility. In addition, okay. the composition no. density prevents you from moving quickly. All right, so I guess I did that one. How many? Where is it? Where? Brackets mounting the tank to the module. You'd better find them all and detach them before you start, or at best, all this debris will right be torn apart with the tank right here. Okay, sure. Uh, I still got a bunch of auction candles, and I don't mind using them. I'm not gonna go back again. A repair tool. All right, put you away. I have to keep putting it away or I'm gonna end up repairing this thing. I only got a couple more uses. All right. The brackets mounting the tank to the module. You'd better find them all and detach them before you start, or at best, all this debris will spin and be torn apart with the tank right here. I understand. You can try to repair the bracket, but since you will destroy it during the repair process, it will be easier to break it beforehand. What? This all oh, right there. Okay. So I need to just just chuck this thing at it. All right, there we go. That worked. Are we good? I think. I don't know. Uh, what is it bracketing on? Something up there. Yeah, let me get back on this. All right. Let me get off for a second. I'm supposed to scan this thing. Place. Okay. One of six engines scanned. I gotta scan six. Is this another one? Okay. So there's two. Oh, there's a lot to this place. Yeah, I hear you, auction. I'll put it. I'll, I'll use the candle as soon as I. Closer to one. Right. Here we go. Everything's fine. Someone clearly overestimated the value of the mayonnaise, allocating an autonomous tank for it equipped with an auto flight system. Although, considering our situation, it's a great opportunity to launch it without any problems by fixing one of the engines and disengaging the tank from the module. I am not sure about the composition of modern mayo products, and therefore I advise you to be careful. Their current physical properties are unknown. Okay. Uh. I don't see anything else over here, and this is. I think it's just like a frozen ball inside of this. I move at 19 when I'm in here. Alright. Yep, I regret coming in here. How do I get out? <gasps> That's awful. <laughs> I hate that. Alright, I gotta scan. Oh, God. It just hit me. I have to scan how many? Three more? I hope we won't need that. Small modern engines can do without burning fuel, which is much safer. Okay, did I only have to get three? Are we good after three? The three is six. I'm gonna scan more just in case. Yeah, four of six. Alright, I don't have a lot of scans left. What is over here? Go check this out real quick. Already here. Place, but maybe we can find something useful here. That's why I'm coming to check it out. Um, exhibition stand. All right, a bunch of hamsters in there. All right, well I'm gonna get back on here. We're just gonna go back. Anything else right around here? 
feel like maybe going to this. This is in a suspicious place. Yeah, there's something in there. Be red. Nope. Nope. It's all red, I swear. I, I don't know. Maybe not. You see, there's a glowy red bit in there. Like, right. Oh, it's the reflection, isn't it? Dude. Like, I think there's one or two good things inside these. Maybe not. Maybe just be storytelling stuff. I don't know. I'm going to have to use another auction candle in a minute. How many do I have? I still have three. That's fine. Alright, I still have to scan the engines. So two more engines to find. That one there. Oh, there's these two right here. All right, oh, we're good. Right? Did I scan these ones? Tell me I haven't. Yes, good. Perfect. Maneuver engine. Right? Ah, uh, you. There must be some control systems inside. If the airlock isn't damaged, then we need to find it. Get into the tank, start the engine, somehow leave before it starts, and hope that when flying away, the tank will have collected at least some part of the flowing spilled mayo. Nope, nope, nope. Down here. Ugh. An airlock. Seems to be intact. All right. Seems like the gas coming into the mayo doesn't let it freeze. We've been over this. I have a feeling that something is wrong with this mayonnaise. Apart from the inconsistency of composition, overly complex technologies are used to transport such biological debris. Although, all the tanks are specified as mayonnaise ones in all the invoices related to the liner. This vacuum cleaner is called Rocket for a reason. With it having such powerful <sighs> power, it is really possible to fly it if you bypass some technical limitations. I don't... I don't... I don't have a scanner! I'm gonna have to go back anyways. Fine. Unbelievable. This is heaven knows what, but it's certainly not a simple tank for storing food products. A detailed plan of the transport module. Oh my god, that's what I want so I can make a vehicle place. Alright. Alright. Uh, you, give me those. My inventory's full. That's fine. Like I said, we'll have to come back here. Whoa! There's no gravity. Oh, nope, stop. Now I have gravity again. Okay. <laughs> a special patch and a bloated spacesuit indicating increased gas production due to excessive broccoli eating. All this points out that the body belongs to the Green Universe Radical Group. If the possible moral constraints are no problem, this bag of methane, hydrogen, and organic residues can be used to provide initial acceleration to the centrifuge. You only need to figure out how to do it. Oh, uh, ignite? Igniter required. Oh, that was the thing I got. Okay. Uh, the comrade 20 above the comrades. Commands order stop. Liner unnamed at point 15 and wait further instructions. You want evidence the green universe being involved in the disaster, although there is no order stating that about blowing oneself up together with the entire liner. The data analysis on the crash of the liner and the nature of the damage allows us to state with great confidence that the damage caused to the bayo tanks by the abruptly stopped centrifuge was one of the causes of the liner's depressurization and its ejection from the warp. All data indicate that the mayonnaise is not mayonnaise, and the tank was an integral part of the systems of the liner unnamed. We have to start the centrifuge, even just out of scientific interest. All right. Mm. Looks like we need to go outside and check the tank engines. All right. Well, I've already scanned them all. My God, there's so much stuff on my screen. I'm gonna have to go through after recording and like turn off a bunch of bunch of the tracking places, like all these oxygen places that are really far away and everything. I don't really need those. Oh, I gotta scan a bunch of stuff. Alright, so I definitely need to make a new scanner and come back with that. Where's the repair thing you want me to do? Okay, so I want to scan that. Okay, I want to scan that. Where exactly was the gold that you just gave me? 
45 meters that way? Outside the ship. Back into the mayonnaise. Or not mayonnaise, man. Alright, blip. Place? Oh wait, I actually got to replace them? Just that one? Or all of them? I think just that one. The only one that says replace. Alright, so we gotta go back. We gotta make the igniter. And we gotta make a... An engine... Scanner. I, I don't think we're gonna do that today. I think I'm gonna just stop at a couple other points on the way back. Because I would like to just try to get some more stuff. If I could. Right here. You're suspicious. Got anything new for me? I already go flying through here, I feel like I did. No? Underpants with studs, space and suit. <laughs> Space who can since here there sincerely consider this to be closed and working with this building otter. I'm done talking. It's like super late at night. My brain apparently shut down after the robot thing. My brain literally did just like I I I, I couldn't even comprehend what had happened. This is what happened earlier. Stop doing this. You keep making it so I can't move. We're going like five inches a second. Okay, where's my... There it is. It's over there. Okay, so there was one or two places I hadn't visited. Uh... On such old docking airlocks, there must be some detailed information on how to disassemble, maintain, and repair them. Probably. What? I would have passed completely right by that. I had no idea this was a thing. Right? I uh, did you what? Oh, there's a thing here, docking area. I don't have a scanner. It doesn't matter. Oh. All right, where's my vehicle? Right there. I need to go. I need to go back. See, these are just things though that I now can go out and scan later on. You've seen such a lamp somewhere already. I think you could assemble one like this yourself, for some unknown purpose. Alright, there's another lamp. There's so much stuff to scan. Docking gates. These are obsolete, although they come in quite handy in case of emergency evacuation. Isn't this what I need for my rope? My Oh my god. Alright, well, there we go. We've gotten so much stuff to scan. Like, these are all things to add, but I'm pretty sure this is what you actually need to basically dock with this vehicle and make vehicles and I'm pretty sure you make it on the docking thing there's so much stuff yeah 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 I'm gonna have to use a candle I already figured that out what's this looks like there was a fight here judging by the tracks two attackers knocked their opponent to the ground and tried kicking him for a long time after which the victim died of old age as the attackers missed every time okay is there anything special here there's just like a little it's I like these just little stories. Like, there's not always an item to get, but it's just little stories. One of the things that makes this game so good is these random weird events that happen. But, okay, so yeah, today, use the giant gun, destroy the ship. Got, what, three of things done now? Most of the way done, I feel like, with that, all we gotta do is just make stuff and go back there next time. Uh... Okay, so over there was yeah that's where I was that's the mayonnaise thing these are all the things to scan I'm gonna have to turn off like that bunch of these oxygen things I don't think I'll turn those ones off because I'm gonna probably be going back over there and then we have all of that to do next time too I'm gonna try to like finish this chapter in the next video but I went past my base didn't I? where's my freaking base so confused and discombobulated. Am I directly above it or below it? What's happening? This. This is what I wanted to go to real fast. I'm going to go here real quick before we end this. I, I saw this and I wanted to see if it's a big thing. I mean, I don't know if it's connected to all that, but I keep passing by it. I feel like there's got to be something good here. I still got 100 oxygen. 
So why not? Like, are you are you gonna have something special inside you? And I can at least know. I mean, I just realized I can't scan it. Is it just two tubes? No, there's a chunk Very stack here. Pipeline distribution. Eh? What is this? Improved communications? Okay. Alright, well, unfortunately that was all it was. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna go back in here. I'm gonna... Uh... I don't know if I'll make up the stuff or probably... I'll probably make up this stuff and the next time I'll just go over there and attach it all and continue on with that. But yeah, I'm going to end here. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.